Karibu mtazamaji waziri wa usalama Kithure Kindiki anasema kuwa baadhi ya wafuasi wa Paul Mackenzie wametorokea katika maeneo ya Galana Kulalu na mbuga ya wanyama ya Tavo. Kindiki ambaye kwa sasa ameelekea katika msitu wa Shakahola kadhalika ametangaza kuwa muda wa kafiu eneo hilo umeongezwa kwa kipindi kisichojulikana. Haya ni huku idadi ya waliofariki kutokana na mkasa wa Shakahola ikiongezeka hadi moja baada ya maiti moja kupatikana hapo jana kwa kudinda kupokea matibabu na chakula katika hospitali ya Malindi. Waziri wa Usalama amezindua rasmi awamu ya zoezi la upasuaji wa maiti za wahanga wa imani potovu huko Malindi kusema kuwa mifupa ya watu watano ilipatikana mstuni baada ya zoezi hilo la kufukua maiti. We have evidence of more graves in Shakahola Forest. And therefore, the suspension that took place on Thursday of the exhumation exercise is meant to allow this post-mortem exercise of the 129 bodies that are here to make sure that we are able to free this hospital mortuary because it is of limited capacity and there are other uh, deaths occurring uh, through normal uh, attrition and therefore would like to free the facility, transfer the bodies to a temporary uh, morgue. We'll be announcing further measures to upscale the search and rescue mission to extend to new areas. And number two, we will also be upscaling the rescue mission in terms of the use of technology. We'll also, number three, be upscaling the rescue, search and rescue mission so that we make sure we comb the entire land and make sure every inch, every meter, every kilometer is accounted for and is cleared in terms of search for both life persons or even people who have been buried there.